What's going on everyone? It's Ryan with Hertz Labs here. Today we're going to cover how to upgrade the firmware for your Vaxi XE wireless mouse. Uh, this is a fairly straightforward process, but I've seen some people post on forums about having trouble, so I figured I'd cover it in a video. Um, you'll start out by heading over to Vaxi's website, so that is vaxi.co. Um, as you can see, we're already here, so go ahead and just click on the download button in the top right. This is going to take you to their download page. Um, at the moment, as of the filming this video, they have the new firmware for the MP01S and the Outset AX, um, but we're looking for the uh, newest version for the Vaxi XE. So scroll down a little bit. As you can see, they have the version 5 firmware here. Um, this is the newest firmware as of making this video. So go ahead and click on the download button. It's going to take you to their Google Drive link and we just need to download it from here. And once you have this saved, go ahead and close out of your web browser. So once you have the file open that you downloaded, you're going to extract it to the location of your choosing. And we have it open here. And you can see we have two files here, one for the dongle and one for the mouse. It's super helpful if you have another mouse available to you because when the mouse is not plugged into the dongle um, or the cord, you're basically not going to be able to click. So make sure you have something available to you. That way you can upgrade the dongle and the mouse without actually having to use the XE mouse. So at first we're going to open up the dongle. So go ahead and open up this file and you're going to see the application. Um, go ahead and run this. You can see it opens right up. Sometimes you have to let Windows know that you actually want to run it and run anyway. So go ahead and plug in your dongle to the provided cable. And hit start. All right, pass, so we're good. Go ahead and close out of this. We're going to go to the mouse folder. Go ahead and open up the application for this. Go ahead and take your cable and plug it into your mouse and ensure that your mouse is on. And we're going to go ahead and click start. All right, so we passed on both, so we're all set. We've updated the firmware on the dongle and the mouse. So this has been updating your Vaxi XE wireless mouse to the newest firmware version. Hope this guide helps. Uh, thank you. Have a good rest of your day.